Welcome back. We have a live look outside right now. This is Pismo Beach where it's pretty foggy, similar conditions to what we've been having over the past few mornings or so. It could be a little bit stubborn for this marine layer to lift for us this afternoon. Yesterday it was pretty socked in, not just for Pismo, but other parts of the five cities, Arroyo Grande, even including Grover Beach there. So slightly cooler out at the coast. Other details with your forecast for this morning, taking a look at the satellite radar, we have some patchy drizzle that will continue throughout the morning commute and could actually produce some very light measurable rain in certain areas. Slow clearing for the coastal valleys, limited clearing out at the beaches. Some morning travel alerts here for you. First one, we do have patchy fog. Make sure those headlights are on and then also you might need those windshield wipers as a result of that drizzle. Microclimate model shows we'll continue to see a lot of this fog and marine layer into about the 10 o'clock hour before some pockets start to open up along the coast even, but much of this is going to stay near the south coast region. You can see later tonight, right around 9 o'clock, as soon as we do get some clearing, maybe even along the coast, we have that second wind of that fog and marine layer that will hang out throughout the overnight hours. So it's not going anywhere just yet. Here's a look at that hour by hour for Paso. We have low 50s to start things off and then temperatures continue to rise. Winds will start to pick up too, but not until about the mid afternoon. You can see here we're in the low 80s by one o'clock this afternoon going into two o'clock. Those winds start to increase getting close to 20 miles per hour and that'll be the trend through early this evening for much of our interior valleys and that brings me here to our wind forecast. So really mild calm to kick things off for this morning. But again, when we can see these colors start to pop up here on this map, mostly over the mountains, foothills and interior portions, that indicates that we could experience some gusty conditions through this evening, like I mentioned. But towards the coast, much more calm. And for your upper levels for the Pacific Northwest, we can see here this low pressure starting to build, continuing into the end of your week. What that's going to do is allow us to have some clearing as a result of these gusty winds that will continue to be in the forecast through the weekend, actually. And your current conditions outside, upper 50s in Solving and Santa Maria, mid 50s outside right now in San Luis Obispo and 52 degrees in Paso Robles. Temperatures there going to warm up to about the mid 80s for us today slightly cooler than what we had yesterday. Low 70s for San Luis Obispo still. That also goes for Santa Maria and Santa Barbara. Lompoc will probably be a little bit closer to those upper 60s. And then for Santa Inez Valley, yesterday we were in the low to mid 80s range. Today we're in the mid to upper 70s range. So even cooling down there too. Mid 60s in Pismo Beach, that goes for Los Osos. And then we also have low to mid 60s along the North Coast. Christina, back to you.